Assalamu alaikum. The United Nations says crimes against humanity may have happened in China's Xinjiang. The United Nations Human Rights Chief has released a long-delayed report on abuses in China's Xinjiang region. Despite substantial pressure from Beijing to block the report for the better part of a year, the 48-page document concludes that a serious human rights violations have been committed against Uyghurs and other predominantly Muslim minorities in the region in the name of counterterrorism. China at first denied it was detaining ethnic minorities. But later came to characterize detention camps and the intensive digital surveillance and policing that blankets the region as counterterrorism and economic development initiatives. However, former detainees in Xinjiang have described accounts of physical and mental torture in the region's detention facilities and a network of expanded prisons. Leaked data and whistleblower accounts have turned up internal Chinese government documents confirming the extra-legal detention of ordinary Uyghurs and the prison-like conditions in which they are held and re-educated to be loyal to the Chinese state. The UN said it interviewed of individuals with direct and first-hand knowledge of the situation in Xinjiang. Allegations of patterns of torture or ill treatment including forced medical treatment and adverse conditions of detention, are credible, as are allegations of individual incidents of sexual and gender-based violence, the UN report said. Bachelet, the former president of Chile, expressed a desire to visit the region herself after beginning her tenure as the UN's top human rights officer, in 2018. In May this year, she finally managed to visit Xinjiang as part of a controversial, six-day fact-finding mission, which human rights activists criticized for being highly stage-managed by Chinese authorities. On the visit, she also talked to China's leader Xi Jinping by video, a conversation in which Chinese media quoted her as praising the country's human rights record. She expressed admiration for China's efforts and achievements in eliminating poverty, protecting human rights and realizing economic and social development, according to a readout from China's state news agency Xinhua. Human rights groups say China, a permanent member of the UN Security Council, has been rapidly building up coercive leverage within the multinational institution in part to stymie meaningful investigation into human rights abuses. China's introduced competing narratives at the UN that try to block or weaken UN resolutions on civil society and human rights, said Maya Wang, a senior China researcher at advocacy group Human Rights Watch. Courtesy NPR